Hey, hi everyone. So in this second video on Elasticsearch, I will be walking you through some features of Elasticsearch, namely index template and component templates. In my previous video, I talked about indexes, how to create them, how to retrieve, update, delete, and the difference like put and post. And this video, I will be showcasing index template, which is basically a blueprint on how we want to define some settings and once the index template is in place any index that we create will get those settings automatically second is component template basically it's more uh, granular and we can define settings which can be inherited by index template and then finally by the index so index get uh, settings uh, inherited directly from index template and the component template so i, I think it will be get more clear as i walk you through so let's get started uh, so first I will create an index template. Uh, the name is students and index pattern. This is a must field. So if the index name start with students dash, it can be anything after that. It will get those settings. So I have mentioned settings as number of shards equal to one and number of replicas equal to zero. And I submit that. So this uh, index template has been created. And just to let you know, I am using command I and command enter to auto indent and send the request so you will find those keyboard shortcut over here if you click help you can see those command i auto indent current request and command enter submit request so that's why i'm not pressing anything on my uh, on the ui so okay so that index template has been created and what we need to do next uh, do next is we can just confirm so we can do get index template students and we can see our settings which has gone in number of shards and number of replicas uh, next is um, we can create an index so once we create an index automatically they will it will get those settings so we can just confirm it by doing a get on that index so if we do get on student stash to, to, to so i have given let's let's say this is the index name with every year we create index and um, for every like next year it will be different index right so it will get all those settings from based on index pattern and the template settings that we have defined so you can see this index got the setting right number of uh, replicas equal to zero and number of uh, shards right so you will see number of shards and number of replicas right okay so moving on so we can just confirm the health of our cluster indices so we can see that uh, students index has been created with one primary replica and the health is green so okay so this was the uh, this was uh, done so next is we can just i will just delete the uh, that particular index because i'll show i'll be showing the component template next so okay if, uh, so i'll just create uh, delete the index template as well uh, and that is also acknowledged now i'll showcasing the component template so uh, component template uh, the path is basically starts with component template and then you can give any arbitrary name so i'm giving my settings and i have provided some some values like similar previously which i provided right number of uh, number of uh, number of shards and number of replicas which i provided right so this is uh, this is part of my settings so i can reuse that so this is also created uh, let me get some space here so i can just confirm whether that thing has successfully gone in so i can see my uh, my component uh, template settings has gone in so next we will see how to use that in index template so what we need to do is uh, again create the index template and give a name so in this case i am giving students and index pattern i am giving students dash star same as before but you will see this new thing here now which is basically composed of and composed of should include the name of your component which is my setting which i gave in here right so this has taken that particular setting and i am putting it's got acknowledged so it's all good okay so now moving on uh, next we can uh, confirm our index template 
so okay so that also has you can see clearly like index it is composed of my settings so it's slightly different this time and now uh, we can uh, create an index st students similar to like previously i get some space over here and then if we do students we'll do a get on in students index we will see the settings that we have given through index template and the and the component template so you will see number of shards number of replicas and it has taken those settings and finally we can uh, finally we can just put some record in the students table so i'm just giving students student id and name and a course so okay so the request has successfully sent in and the record has been created and it has taken those settings from the whatever we gave through index template and the component template and finally we can uh, get back the record so record is successfully uh, came back and last if you want to clean up you can remove the index the template and the component so these thing three things okay so you can just uh, send this one by one click here click here and click here yeah so that's it guys this was a quick demo on index template and component template and how to use them so i hope you like this particular video and please like share subscribe and comment thank you very much